Greetings. Welcome back to my devotions. Grace and peace be with you. My topic for today is crying out to God. And my scripture reading will be coming from St. Matthew 14 verses 29 and 30. And I'll read. And he said, come. And when Peter was come down out of the ship, he walked on the water and go to Jesus. But when he saw the wind boisterous, he was afraid and beginning to sink. He cried saying, Lord, save me. So the phone rings and you answer. A sullen voice informs you of a tragedy. Your heart is so heavy that you feel as though you could die. What do you do? Bad news, danger, and pain all cause us to look for help. As believers, we dwell with the Almighty God, who is able to hate us. At those moments when we are sideswiped by life's circumstances, we should cry out to him. In the Bible, crying out refers to speaking audible with great emotion concerning an urgent need. God invites us to use this form of prayer to communicate that we desperately need his mercy. It takes both faith and humility to share our heart's concern aloud. Crying out then is a way for God's children to express trust in the Lord's ability and willingness to help. By calling upon him with such urgency, we also lay down our pride and any attitude of self-sufficiency. The word of God assures us that our Father hears our cries and responds. In Psalms chapter 3 verse 4, David said, I cried unto the Lord with my voice and he heard me out of his holy hill. When we call aloud for help in Jesus' name, we invite his power into the situation. Remember that there is strength in just speaking his name. When we cry out to God, he may remove the problem immediately, yet we often have to wait for his perfect timing. Harsh circumstances might even be allowed to remain for his good purposes. But we can always count on his comfort and presence which enables us to live with joy and hope. Let us pray. Heavenly Father who art in heaven, in the name of Jesus Christ, we come before your presence this morning. We thank you, Lord, for this another day. Another day that you have raised us up. Father God, your mercies are renewed and great is thy faithfulness. Thank you that you are God Almighty who was and is to come. Thank you for Jesus' sacrifice on the cross of Calvary with his death and resurrection. My salvation is secure in you. Help me to realize that you are in total control and you have me in the palm of your hands. Thank you that I can come to you with boldness. You said to ask and it will be given. Seek and you shall find. Knock and it shall be opened. I ask that you pour out your supernatural power to those who need healing or this time. Show them your power and strength. Show them that you are God and you never fail. Let them be witness of your healing power. Let them be able to tell others about you. I give you all the glory and honor that is due to your name. In Jesus' precious name I pray. Amen. Thank you for listening. 
I hope you have been blessed. If you are new to my channel, welcome. I pray that you will have a wonderful and blessed day. God bless you. Peace.